Hi Yarnabees, it's Sandy. I'm just here to share a couple things with you. Sorry if I feel if I'm a little out of breath. I just took the dog for a bit of a walk, getting my exercise in for the day. You know, always know it's a bad thing when you go to the the um, the walkway or wherever you're walking, and an ambulance and a fire truck pull up. <laughs> you're going um okay. So they went over to, there's like a little bridge that goes over and who knows, it could have been a homeless person under the bridge or I don't know. I didn't go check it out. I was just like, okay, Bailey, we're going this way. <laughs> it's like, no, nope, don't need any of that. Okay. Huh. Um, sorry, she's naked. She's naked because I haven't made anything for her yet <laughs> to like to cover where I'm, I'm on the hook. I have something, but, uh, well, let's do that first. I was in Walmart getting some groceries and I got a text message from my sister, Charlene, and she was asking me if she could commission me to do a pocket shawl for her friend for Christmas. <laughs> I was going, Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought it was over and done doing pocket shawls, but I guess not. <laughs> so, so she wanted it in blue. So I got her some, um, oh, really? The heck am I trying to say here? It's the Walmart basics. No, premier, pre oops, sorry, premium. I use it all the time. Are you kidding me? And I can't even think for the life of me what it's called. Oh, Burnett Premium. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, I don't have the ball band with me. <clears throat> but it's Burnett Premium and it's kind of like a jean color. Oh, that's like really blowing it out. It's, it's more like that. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, really pretty color. I have frogged this thing three times, three times. I, uh, I don't know. I, thinking about it now, I probably should have done two balls, two strands uh, to make it thicker so that it would go faster and it would be a little more bulky, but I didn't. So, it's going to be a little bit thinner, I think. I After I wash it, I'll see how it plumps up. But, uh, and I'm doing the Bernat Premium in white as well to do the outline. But, can you see that? I don't know if you can tell what stitch that is. It's the double crochet cross, double, uh, the, the crossover stitch or crisscross stitch or whatever it is. Uh, and then I just did some half double crochets in the back loop um, for the border. <clears throat> but I think it's going to turn out really pretty. It's just going to take me a while to do because it's thinner yarn. So, but uh, I think once it's done, it's going to look nice. I think she'll be happy with it. So that's all my... What the, <laughs> Yeah, that's what's on my hook right now, uh, besides my daughter's um, gift. That one's not going to take me as long, so I figured I better get started on this. I didn't think I was going to have to frog it. All Like I tried the Bag O' Day pattern with this yarn. It was going to take me a year to finish it. I just, And also... Um, was it the Bag of Day one or was it the other one that I tried? I tried another one too, but it had, what was it? The crisscross stitch and then a front post double crochet, crisscross stitch, front post. The thing started to curl up so bad. I thought, you know what? There's no way in hell I'm going to be able to uncurl this when it's done. And it's when you wash it, I like I could block it. But then if you wash it, it's just going to, it's going to look like hell. So I thought, nah, no, frog it, start again. And this has 300 stitches. 
300 stitches long. So yeah, uh, that's why my ball looks like this. I had to fold it in half and then wrap it. <laughs> it's just, it's a mangled mess. But anyway, I've been on a real hat kick lately, which is probably a good thing. This is usually when I start doing my hats for craft fairs and scenes that I, I haven't heard. I got to phone them today. I have not heard from them to say, yes, we are going ahead with it or the craft fair or no, we're not. Nothing. And we've got like a couple of weeks until the craft fair is supposed to. Be. And I'm just like, seriously? Oh, <sighs> so yeah. But anyway, um, I, I, has charisma changed? I don't know because I was using the um, Loops and Threads Charisma and it is so soft and plush and, and beautiful. Like this hat's, I had to keep one. I made this one and I went, okay, I'm keeping this one because it is so fluffy and soft. I don't remember Charisma being quite this fluffy. And then I used another Charisma and it didn't seem as fluffy. So I don't know what's going on with them. But anyway, uh, I did this one. It's more of a slouchy. And I did, oop, I did a puff stitch. And uh, double crochets, I believe. Yeah. So I'll show you, excuse my hair, dog, dog walking hair. <laughs> so there's that one. It's, it's got a lot of texture to it. Um, and then I made this one, which is, oh, what stitch is this? Popcorn stitch, I think. Uh, so, yeah. So I made that one, but they're so soft and so squishy. It's just insane. And then I used, like I said, excuse my, my I'm sweating. So my hair is like awful. That's why I'm wearing a hat. And then, oh, that color. Oh, hang on. That color was strawberry. And then this one is the Charisma, but it's got the old ball band on it. Or is that the new ball band? I can't remember. Um, and this color is, where's the color? Oh. Uh, Sweet Dreams. <clears throat> So, and these are not patterns that I, um, that I read. These are my own patterns <clears throat> that I haven't done a tutorial on or written up or anything. And then with this one, I made a cowl with the little, um, toggle. I can't put it on because I have my mic on, but yeah, so you wear it like like that <laughs> so that was fun but it's so like marshmallowy squishy you know like so nice so whoop let me put my hat back on yeah that's better <laughs> and then um you remember i was telling you that i went to fabric land and i went and I picked up I picked up I went and picked up some yarn that is I guess they're it's going to be their their new brand and it's called spindle yarn this is not the yarn that I used it was the other one the little cakey thing uh but I forgot to forgot to uh, um save the ball band this yarn oh, I love it I love it. It kind of reminds me of Charisma, but it's so stinking soft. It's like, it's really nice. 
it's actually darker than that. It's like that color. But it's, oh, here we go again. It's so, so soft. It's really nice. And I made two of those. I think I made the same. Yeah, I made the same. Oh, sorry. Bailey. Sorry, guys. Come here. No. Um, so I made two of those out of both. Uh, about one, one skein made one hat. And I had a little bit left over. So that was nice. So next, I'm going to use this one. And I have an idea for a new hat design. I'm not sure if it's going to work out but I'm going to try it out and see what happens. If it doesn't, if it works out, I'll show you guys. If it doesn't, I guess you guys won't see it. <laughs> so yeah, so this, this is the uh, melange, 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 whatever, 100% acrylic. And it's called cherry pie. And again, it's that dark that color um so i this one's a lot thinner a lot thinner than uh the other one so i may have to use two strands i don't know yet we'll see how it goes <clears throat> so that's all i've made so far and what's on my hook there's some, oh, I don't know what Bailey's growling at, but it's got to be something good. <laughs> she kept us up last night growling and barking and snarling and, oh, um, anyway, big news. Darla, Crafty Yarn Owl with Darla has got the Sisterhood of the Traveling Hook. I, she has put one, um, one video out receiving the hook and showing it i will put that link down below all of the links for everybody that receives the hook it will be a permanent link down below <coughs> to their video as well as being in the playlist uh so i will link that one that one i think is already linked down below uh, i'm just waiting for her new video to show what she's made i'm so excited so yeah so um that should be fun. Yeah. Uh, is there anything else? <clears throat> Still working on the boxes for the uh, 25 days of Christmas. Um, <clears throat> what else? Oh, I received the right gift that I got for George. Uh, so, <laughs> so that's good. Um, it came pretty quick too. I was really surprised. So, um, I don't know what else to say. Uh, I, 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 yeah, I don't know. I'm probably going to be making a lot of hats in the next little while. So, <clears throat> um, let me know below if you guys are, would be interested in me putting um wearables and stuff in my etsy shop if you'd be i you know what hold on one sec oops accidentally turned off my camera <laughs> um i i don't talk about my etsy store all that much i probably should uh but the way i see it is there's nothing that i i make that i'm sure that you guys don't already make so um, for me to say, oh, go to my Etsy shop and buy this and buy that, it, it seems futile for me because it's not something that you guys can't make yourself, right? If you're interested in something I show, if you, if you want to buy something that I've shown, let me know. But, um, you know, in my Etsy shop, I have... Uh, patterns like hat patterns and whatnot and I have um stitch markers and I don't really show 
a whole lot of the stitch markers that I made. I don't know why I didn't do that. I, I mean, I briefly showed stuff, but I've basically just said, hey, you know, that it's in the in the Etsy shop. So one thing I I will reiterate, I guess, is that I have some stitch markers that have um, birthday signs on them, like Capricorn, Taurus, Libra, all that kind of stuff. Whoops. So, uh, and then on the back of them, they have, you know, what that sign represents. So I have those, see, like, oops, and I only have one of each, but they are on my Etsy shop. Oh, come on. Don't be like that. Are you being shy? Oop. Okay. Come on. There we go. See? So I have, I have those in my shop among other, other ones. Um, I have, doop, 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 like these kind and like I have angels and I have I have lots of different ones in there and then I've also got some that have oop, come on open there we go. some that have like three on them okay so if you're interested, go check it out. I have changed the shipping on them. I've done a flat rate shipping on them um, because I was having some issues before with uh, Etsy putting their own shipping, outrageous shipping on them. So I've changed that. Uh, what else? So if you, if you are interested, see, I, I just don't put like hats and stuff on my Etsy because when I do craft fairs, they sell so fast and then I haven't got them, but, uh, this year is different this year, uh, because I've only got the one, I'm probably going to have a lot of stock left over, but there's so much stock that I can't possibly put them all on my Etsy store. Uh, yeah, <clears throat> but if you're interested, if there's something that you don't make that I do make, uh, let me know. And, uh, if you're, if you're interested in me making you something, commissioning me to make you something, as long as it's not like crazy stuff, like something I can't figure out or can't do. <laughs> Amigurumi. Mm -mm. I don't do that. <laughs> There's lots of other YouTubers that do amigurumi that uh, are fantastic at it. I am not one of them. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> uh, yeah, but I don't know. Let me know. But like I say, like I'm going to try and get a couple of tutorials out this week. Um, but if you, I mean, I've got so much stuff on my table right now. I really need to deal with this because it's it's getting out of control. Um, and then I can do my tutorials. So, <clears throat> but I mean, they're, they're not going to be major tutorials. It's just going to be like a hat or something like that. Although there is one thing. Uh, I think I designed a stitch by accident. So and it's for a dishcloth. I know, right? Like I don't do dishcloths. I don't know what it, what I have no idea what happened, but, um, I mean, really you could do that stitch on, for anything. Um, but yeah, it's, yeah, it's different anyways. Uh, so I might do a quick tutorial on that. I don't know yet if I can remember how I did it. <laughs> 
Um, oh, my witch hat. Oh, I, it's been pushed to the side and pushed to the side. I don't think I'm going to get it done for Halloween. I'm so bummed out. So, um, but uh, it was it was fun doing it while I did it. <laughs> you know. Um, yeah, so I, I don't think there's anything else to talk about. This was a short one again uh hopefully later i'll have more to talk about <laughs> so, okay i'll talk to you guys later i love you all Mwah. bye <laughs>